Hey everyone, in today's video I'm going to teach you how to use some basic statistical functions within Excel 2010. So this is going to be valuable to you if you have a data set and you want to be able to crunch some numbers on it, like for example calculate the average or find the minimum value. So for these six functions, it's going to be the exact same method for each one. All you do is you type the function name and then select the range, close the parentheses, that's it. Countif is the only one that's different, so I'll just save that for the end. So to calculate the sum, you just type equal sum parentheses. Click and hold so that you can select this entire range. Once you have that selected, close the parentheses and hit enter. And there you go. And it's going to be the exact same method for the rest of these statistical functions. And by the way, max calculates the maximum value, min calculates the minimum value. And then the count function simply counts the number of data points that are in the data set. So when I select these eight points, it's going to give me the number eight. Now count if is the only one that's a little bit different because it has the if function nested within it and the if function requires a logical test. So for the count if, first we're going to specify the range of data that we're looking at and then we're going to supply a criteria. So let's say I want to count the number of values within this data set that is greater than 300. So first I select the range which is A3 through A10 comma and now I'm going to type in greater than 300 and I have this in parentheses that's very important or quotation marks I should say so once you have that specified hit enter and there you have it it's showing the number three because there are only three values within this data set that fit that criteria so I hope this video was valuable to you if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment if you'd like to check out more videos like this just subscribe to my channel or check out my website that's bonetti thanks for watching